Hey, uh, how's it going? Going great. Thank you both so much for taking the time to speak with me today. And congratulations on American Ross. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Uh, it is such a compelling season. It is also one of those, it's one of those shows I always, I, I love when I get really dramatic stuff. And it's like, I, my energy is so peppy and energetic. Let's talk about some dark stuff. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Uh, but I kind of wanted to start with uh, Rob. Like, this is a bit of a return for Steve. This is, you know, kind of stepping back into the role after the initial stuff <laughs> with, with American Ross's first season. What was it like to kind of step back into Steve and not uh, and to get to see him kind of moving into his own new position in, in the show? It's, it's it's great. It's I mean, it's it's great to return to Pittsburgh to to, to continue on a show. So I I. I I thought it was great, um, it, you know, and, and the storyline, it, it just where it picks up from the, the first season where, you know, Steve has his suspicions um, about Dell Harris, you know, it, it sort of picks up where he, you know, the second season, for the most part, like I'm not I'm not in these these scenes with uh, with uh, Jeff Jeff this time um, as Harris. So it it kind of mirrored what's going on in the story. Um, for for this season of just being, you know, like I'm I'm after Harris now, or I, you know, I've got the suspicions. So I didn't, you know, so this this season I I didn't get to spend that much time with him, you know, because I was like looking for him, both you know, personally on set, you know, hey Jeff, where are you? You know, I, I <laughs> abandoned me like that, you know. So it's it's um it's 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 nice to return to something. This is Brad with Zachary Van Hashtag so. Uh, hashtag show. Sorry, it's early. <laughs> hey, uh, how's it going? Going great. Thank you both so much for taking the time to speak with me today. And congratulations on American Ross. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Uh, it is such a compelling season. It is also one of those, it's one of those shows I always, I, I love when I get really dramatic stuff and it's like, I, my energy is so peppy and energetic. Let's talk about some dark stuff. Okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, but I kind of wanted to start with uh, Rob. Like, this is a bit of a return for Steve. This is, you know, kind of stepping back into the role after the initial stuff <laughs> with, with American Ross's first season. What was it like to kind of step back into Steve and not and to get to see him kind of moving into his own new position in, in the show? Oh, it, it's it's great. It's I mean, it's it's great to return to Pittsburgh to. To, to continue on a show. So I I I, I thought it was great. Um it, you know and and the storyline it, it just where it picks up from the the first season where you know Steve has his suspicions um about Dell Harris, you know it it sort of picks up where he you know the second season for the most part like I'm not I'm not in these these scenes with uh with uh Jeff Jeff this time. Um, as Harris, so it it kind of mirrored what's going on in the story um, for for this season of just being, you know, like I'm I'm after Harris now, or I, you know, I've got the suspicions. So I think you know, so this this season, I, I didn't get to spend that much time with him, you know, because I was like looking for him, both you know, personally on set, you know, hey Jeff, where are you? You know, I, I <laughs> abandoned me like that, you know. So it's it's um. It's 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 nice to return to something. Like the Luna gets the whole bit of you now too. Of like I had Jeff, I had one of Jeff. I think because Luna, you really get to kind of come into the show with a bit more of a genuine night, like by the books. Kindness, there's a sweetness. <laughs> you know, Angela that doesn't get what was it like kind of stepping into American Rust and kind of getting to bring that energy to the show? You know, I was thrilled to step into it, I have to say, because I, I didn't really know much about it. And when I got to see uh, the first season, I just thought it was so wonderful. And, and as you say, compelling and so rich in character work, right? And moved at this pace that was so deliberate and intriguing 
And I thought, I want to play there. I want to be part of that. I want to be sort of in this kind of weird, I don't know what anybody's doing. I'm only guessing at it. As a viewer, I had that feeling. And so coming in as Angela, who's, you know, she's tough, she's savvy. And even still, there's always the, hmm, something was not quite adding up. There's a lot going on underneath. There's more going on. There's so many, I mean, it's an onion, right? There's so many layers in the show and there's so many different ways it could go um to be part of that is really exciting fantastic and then i've got time for one more and this is for both of you so this is something i ask every performer i get the chance to because it's a totally inadaptable question uh whenever you take on a role i imagine you kind of have an idea in your head of like all right i've read the script i've got an idea i, I know what i'm gonna do and that ends up being so different than the final product. That ends up, you find something with the character just by, with, with the scripts, with the cast. Rob, like having the time in between this, the first season and the second season. Like, with that in mind, what would you both say surprised you the most about uh, Rob with Steve and Luna with Angela? Like, what really kind of caught your, you by surprise with the characters? Uh, for me, I can say the humor. And the humor between Angela and Dell was a real, uh, real surprise and and delicious. And I thought, oh, we could play there a little bit more, and and it was just a nice sort of reprieve from the from the seriousness and the intensity of it. So I I, I think that was really cool. Yeah. Um, what was surprising for me? Well, I I guess I didn't I didn't realize that you know you you work on something and then and then you go away and you come back and you you realize that some of the you know the the cop behavior or like the way you stand even with the belt felt more comfortable uh for me because i haven't played you know uh cops with with uh duty belts so often so so this time it, it just felt like oh i know what this feels like so um you know even the way you walk or stand or, or you know like uh you know, walk up to a vehicle. I was like, ah, oh, I feel like I, I know what I'm doing this time. That's mm -hmm. amazing. <laughs> so, a little bit stepping into the role. It's just like moving into the chief role. Uh, yeah. now, uh, Rob Luna, thank you so much for taking the time to speak with me today. Uh, honestly, congrats on the show. I'm so excited for everybody else to see the new season. Uh, have a good rest of the day.